What's up everyone, Matt here and welcome back to the channel. Hansho sent over these LED door seals for the Model 3 and today we're going to get them put on. Now what's really cool about these is the tops are aluminum, so they're not gonna scratch from stepping on them. The bottom is plastic, so it's not gonna mess up your paint when you put them on. And the other cool thing is they are battery powered. So what's great about that is the battery's gonna last about three years is what they're saying. You don't have to wire anything, you don't have to plug them in. You just use the double-sided tape, stick them on. There's a magnet that you're gonna put on the bottom side of the door. So when you open the door, it triggers the sensor to light up the LED. Really cool. Tesla also sells these, but you can get them for a fraction of the price on Han Show's website. On top of that, if you use my discount code, save anywhere from 15 to 25% off. I'll put it in the description below. Let's do this thing. First, let's talk about what's included. You're gonna get two door sills for the back doors, two for the front doors. They're gonna give you some extra double-sided tape, magnets, things like that. You're gonna get some adhesive promoter. I definitely recommend using this. And then these little black circles are templates for where to put the magnets on the bottom of the door. How it works is you put the black sticky with the adhesive side facing up. So then when you close the door, it sticks to the bottom. Then once it's on there, you'll put the magnet inside the circle. The tops of the door sills are made of aluminum, so they won't get scratched up very easily. The bottoms are made of plastic, so you don't have to worry about damaging any of your paint. They can use two different types of batteries, and it's super simple. You just take the battery, slide it underneath the metal tab, and then you put the plastic housing over it. Again, these are supposed to last for about three years without having to replace the battery. And this is what it looks like with the LED light on. You can see when putting the magnet over the sensor, it turns each door sill on. So now let's get started. First thing, you're gonna wanna use some water or an alcohol solution to clean the surface extremely well. Go ahead and clean the current door sills that are in the front, as well as everything in the back and underneath the doors themselves. Then from here, I like to do a test fit just to make sure everything lines up and fits snug. Looks good, so I'm gonna go ahead and push down the battery covers to make sure they're secure and peel off the double-sided tape. Once you have everything ready to go, use the adhesive promoter. I usually like to put it on the double-sided tape itself as well as where I'm gonna stick it. One note is this stuff dries extremely quick, so you're gonna wanna do all the door sills pretty fast or get a couple extra sets of adhesive promoter. Now you're just gonna take the new illuminated door sill and place it over the current one. Make sure you line it up. And after you do this, push down on the double-sided tape for about 30 seconds. Now take the circle sticky templates and you're gonna want to place this adhesive side facing up so it sticks to the bottom of the door. Once you've done this, go ahead and close your door and then open it back up and the template should stick to the bottom of it. Poof, it's gone. Here on the bottom side, you can see the template. Go ahead and take your magnet and put it right in the middle. Theoretically, you could take the template off. I'm gonna leave mine on because why not? Finally, peel off the plastic protective layer and let's move on to the back. Same process here as the front. Make sure you use a water or alcohol solution and clean everything extremely well. So this one's gonna be a little bit more difficult because you don't have a door sill already there to put it over. What I did was I used these two little holes in the weather stripping as a guide and then I lined it up. You don't want it too far to one side or too far the other because it's gonna bow in the middle. Now, honestly, it's a pretty small space and you could totally just eyeball this and it would look great. If you want to, you can get some painter's tape and make a guide. You can see here, once I had it lined up, I used two pieces of blue tape just to put on each side so I had a general idea of where I'd want it to sit. Then you're gonna remove the backing of the double-sided tape, use the adhesive promoter and wipe down the area. After you do this, put it in the right spot and hold down for 30 seconds. The next process is the same as the front door. Remove the template put it upside down so the adhesive side is facing up, and then close the door. Just like magic, it's gone again. Align the magnet inside the middle of the template, and then let's close the door and check out how it looks. And that is the illuminated door sills from Han Show. Again, description and link below. Save 15 to 25% off using my code. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments, and stay tuned for the next video coming out soon.